Jacob Truba warned people yesterday at the podium that this series was not over. He ended up being pretty prescient, unfortunately, for Ranger fans. Here's Jacob Truba after the game. Overall. Uh, not terrible. I think uh, a little more sloppy, I think, than the first two, but it's a 1-1 hockey game going into overtime. Uh, we had our chances to score. I think uh, they had theirs. It's, uh, it's a one-goal game. It's uh, decided late. I don't think it's. Uh, don't think we played a terrible game. Obviously, we knew this was going to be a, a challenge. It's never easy uh, winning four games. It's a, it's a long series. Limited chances for the Devils. Did you feel like you defended for the most part the way you wanted to tonight? Uh, yeah, I mean they're they're obviously a good skilled team. They've showed that all year. They're going to get their chances. I don't think you're going to prevent everything. But uh, yeah, I thought Igor made, made some some big saves. Um, either didn't play a terrible game. Um, it's a one goal game. Those, those happen. Just a matter of not being able to capitalize maybe on the power play might have been different. Um, I mean, our power play has been good. I don't think we're looking at this game saying our power play, we're not going to score two power play goals every game or whatever it is, but uh, I mean, we had our looks. I don't think anybody in here's their goalie played well. I thought their, their team played better. Um, yeah, it's just uh, is what it is. I think uh, we just come back and play game four. Chris, with five goals through three games, just how he's elevated his game so far, how has that reverberated through the rest of the team? Yeah, I think uh, he's been he's been playing well. He's been flying around. Obviously, a big presence in front of the net. He has a shot like he showed tonight. Um, yeah, he's a he's a big leader on this team. I think uh, a guy that I think other teammates gravitate towards and, and watch how he plays and how he works and how physical he is. And he's a uh, he's a leader on our team for sure. Here's a bad chat on what was different about tonight's game. Yeah, I, I think um, you know it's it's. Uh, you're going to turn the puck over at times, but I think uh, at times today we we, uh, uh, we make the wrong decision, um, and uh, you know that's that's what they want. They they want that game. They're they're good. They're pressure. They pressure hard everywhere, and and, uh, and try to force towards turnover so they can get it to their uh, quick forwards and, and go on the counter attack. And, and uh, yeah, I mean, um, uh, we knew this this was going to be a tough game, tough series. So. Um, not happy with the with the loss, but we um, um, again get some rest and, and get ready for game four. Felt like especially in the third and overtime, it kind of turned into a little bit of a track meet. Do you feel like that plays to their strengths? Mm, yeah, um, I thought I thought the first bit in overtime, I thought we come, came out strong. We had some good chances and um, try to you know try to get the momentum, try to get that. Um, Yeah, I mean, and try to get the feel for, um, for just you know, playing in their zone, pressuring, making them chip the pucks out, and, and uh, try to get um, good changes to go back at them again. Um, yeah, it was uh, obviously not good enough today, but um, I think uh, we uh, we know what we have to do, and, and, and uh, we'll look at it and, and um, address those things and, and uh, get back to uh, get back to game four. To get a win. Do you feel like there were a couple of instances where you guys were looking for the extra pass? Yeah, maybe. Um, um, I think they uh, they came up with some big blocks too, and they get in front. Maybe you don't feel like you'd have the lane and, and trying to look for someone else to to uh, get a better opportunity. But um, I thought as the game went on, we, we put more pucks to the net, and I think that's what we gotta keep doing. Messages from the head coach are always interesting to watch after nights like tonight in the playoffs. Here's Gerard Gallant's press conference. It's presented by Chase. No, they they, uh, they did a job adjusting to our power play tonight. I thought the first one was real good. We had some real good looks. And after that, we had a couple, you know, one and out, one and out. But uh, it wasn't as clean. Our execution wasn't as good tonight in the game as it was the other two nights. And that was the biggest difference. Yeah, no, it was a, again, it was a, I thought it was an excellent hockey game. Uh, we weren't as as smooth as crisp. I thought we passed up some scoring chances, especially the first half of the game. We're trying to make passes. But overall, I thought we played a real good game. That extra extra passing in the first two games, there really wasn't any of that. Yeah, we tried to get a little cute, I think. And uh, again, I thought we played well. Those would have been put in the back of the net. I wouldn't have been saying what I'm saying now. Right. but. Uh, you know, they make their plays, we got some talent, but uh, sometimes a little more direct and making it hard than that younger goaltender. So, But he, he made some key saves. Both goaltenders were excellent tonight. I'm, I'm assuming you, you expected some kind of pushback from them in the situation that they're in. Yeah, no, they played. 
I mean, really, the last two games they played pretty well. I mean, we were the five goals we got on the other night. It wasn't that distance of a game. I thought they played hard. They played well, and tonight they played real well. They came in here and uh, skated well and played a hard game. And you know, again, there was a coin toss. It's overtime, and uh, both teams played well. That scuffle there in the second that kind of ended with the monstrosity of penalties. I guess what did that do for you guys on the bench? Uh, kind of with two of you guys in the box and that was. Oh yeah, no, it was uh, obviously Meyer fell on the goalie and uh, Shefsky gave him a couple shots with the blocker. So hopefully they don't fall on the goalie too often. I didn't like it, but that's part of it. It looked like Mika was moved back to the left circle on the power play in late in the third period. Was that something that was planned, or is that just a result of the No, they sort of go. They, they do their own thing. I mean, Mike talks to them before the game about a plan, and I'm sure he looked at them and said, why don't we do a little switch here if you get the chance. But He was able to get some shots from the slot. He the, had two good shots from the yeah. slot. Yeah, real good chances, opportunities there. So. Probably some of the bigger saves that goal had made. Yeah, definitely. Definitely. All right. Thank you. Thank you.